Hello there guys and gals, how are you today? It's Pearl Jr. here. Um, just really, really quickly, um, you know, what are we gonna do about mass shootings? I mean, really. Um, no one's popped up, so I don't even know if I'm on live or not. Oh, there is someone, okay. Um, especially little kids. I mean, everybody's life is important, but little kids that are innocent is just horrific. And I know Michael's heart is breaking um, because I know he did a speech and he said we didn't need metal detectors in schools. Yeah, we do. Everybody that comes into a school needs a metal detector, okay? Um... Uh, they need to be uh, they need to be patted down and that's where we're at you know unfortunately and I got his point many years ago when he said that we didn't need metal detectors in schools because kids aren't you know shooting up people um, but now um, 18 year olds are shooting up grocery stores and uh, and little and, and elementary schools and it happened you know 10 years ago 15, I don't know, Sandy Hook, which killed more and like over 20 people in uh, four minutes. And what did this guy killed his grandmother and was so mad at that that didn't satisfy him enough that he had to go on a high speed taste and just go into a school and just kill him. You know, I remember there was a lot of serial killers around the 60s and 70s and 80s, like Ted Bundy, uh, the Night Stalker, uh, Jeffrey Dahmer. You know, and we don't hear about, about those kind of serial killers as much because we psychoanalyze them. So, yes, these people need to be psychoanalyzed. And, uh, and we need to figure out ways um, not to create that kind of uh, anger, um, vitriol, evil in people. So, you know, thoughts and prayers, everybody's not supposed to say it, but what else do you say? Um, to people who have lost their little tiny little kids. Oh my God. Anyway, guys, there are just a few things that I'm going to talk about. It's only going to take a, a couple minutes. Um, did you guys know that Brandon Howard was with Angel? You know, Joe Jackson's publicist. Did you know that? Yes, that's Brandon and Angel Hoansky. Hey, Angel girl. Okay. Um, and he was also with Ola Ray too. And uh, and Alberto Alvarez, you guys remember him? He's the one that called 911 for Michael. He uh, is now the uh, security for Harry and Meghan Markle. So uh, Harry, you know, the uh, you know, I, I remember the their last name, but I can't ever remember, you know, the 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 queen's last name. And I know some people eh, his last name. I can't remember because she just goes by Elizabeth. One name. Okay, um, uh, rest in peace, Ray Liotta, um, rest in peace, my God. And then I did a video about the corner lying. It's on my Facebook page. I want you guys to watch it. And then on my Instagram page, I did find, you know, I find old stuff. Oh, and then the Michael Jackson was so happy that, um, and, and Blackish, which I think is a great, great show, uh, Michael Jackson's official website. Uh, they went ahead and they um, uh, thanked Blackish for uh, doing a dance to beat it, which is really cool. And uh, um, but you know, Michael has been investigated by. I have to say this. I've written it a couple times. The FBI and you know CIA because Australia and Canada and the UK, you know, accusations. So, of course, the CIA was involved, but they're so covert, covert you'll never know. And uh, LAPD, Los Angeles Police Department, Santa Barbara Police Department, uh, two grand juries, uh, uh, a trial, uh, hundreds of media outlets, if not thousands, um, and uh, still nothing, okay? Nothing, nothing. So... Um, I'm just, uh, child and family services, nothing. And we have to be grateful that Michael's not canceled. I mean, look at Elvis not canceled. And we know he was seeing Priscilla when she was 14. We know that. Uh, we know that Woody Allen, uh, married his daughter. Okay. We know these things and there's not the same vitriol of 
like, you know, being afraid to tell people you're a Michael Jackson fan because you don't know their reaction to it because he's been uh, falsely accused of being like the world's worst pedophile when he's the most investigated person when it comes to that ever um, with cameras everywhere, cameras all over Neverland. I mean, it's just outrageous. So we should feel proud to be a Michael Jackson fan. Okay, so on my Instagram, and I got like one minute and then I got to go. Of course, I got to go to work. And on my Instagram page, uh, I posted this. And I think that this is kind of important (laughs) to kind of review. Okay, because everybody, everybody is not, um, everybody uh, doesn't know everything that's ever been reported. And there's a lot of people that are newbies that missed a lot of the uh, first early clues. Okay, at the Michael Jackson's memorial. Okay, the memorial. I'm alive and I'm here forever. Why put that there? Unless you, you, you don't know if you're going to get caught or not. So you're trying to create plausible uh, deniability. Well, I tried to tell. The Michael album. I live. Come on. Come on on the lip. Michael commissioned this. Okay. Um, uh, Michael Jackson, immortal. Immortal, not dead. Okay. His, uh, that place, Circus where Michael Jackson lives on. These are not, and then here is uh, Chris Angel, uh, Believe, that's why we call Believers. Um, Look at the Michael Jackson, the top, matches with uh, Chris Angel, the bottom of his poster. I mean, and there's just so much more. I mean, there's just like tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of more clues. I'm making sure I'm not forgetting something. Tons and tons and tons of more clues. So if you haven't watched my live docu-series, please do, okay? I'm trying to work on something, but I'm trying to hear back from somebody, but I'm trying to work on something. Um, So go to my website, michaeljacksoninsider.com, and uh, I'll see you next time. Okay, bye-bye.